Hey guys. Oh, my makeup looks so bad. Okay, hopefully that's better. I thought I would vlog myself eating this. This is a Korean traditional snack. It's like not a cookie. It's like a sugary sweet. It's not bread. Mmm. Can you guys hear me? Is that ASMR? I just came back from work. It's so good. Mm. Last time in my vlog, I was mentioning To Kill a Mockingbird. I finished reading To Kill a Mockingbird and now I'm, I'm reading this one. This is Oscar Wilde's The Picture of Dorian Gray. The plot sounds so interesting. I looked at the book collection that we have at home. My brother and I have a little like cupboard of books we don't have that many books because we just got rid of a lot of books that we don't really read or we've read i've been really into reading fiction these days i kind of stopped reading my self-help book it's just been going on for too long and i kind of got bored of it to kill a mockingbird was amazing i really liked it i think a lot of people these days have complaints about that book because it's from a white author written for a white audience but the book is being forced to i guess people are kind of forced to read it in a sense in schools because it teaches about race relations the question arises should a book written by a white woman for a white audience about a white savior is that really a good representative about today's race relations in the u.s i don't think so i don't think there's a lot of people or characters like Atticus, but I feel like it just kind of seems like very white savory. But when you just look at the book itself and you just look at it as like a work of literature, I, I quite enjoyed reading it. And I think if you only take Harper Lee's To Kill a Mockingbird and believe that, oh, this is a perfect representation about the relationship between black and white people in the US, then it's wrong. But if you're reading it as literature, I think it's a, a masterpiece. I, I think it's amazing and I, think Harper really deserves credit for that. And I think it does make some interesting commentaries too. I can see why it is a little bit problematic just to push Harper Lee, really, but I feel like you should still be taught to read this and think of it in a critical manner. And as long as the analysis after reading the book is critical and multifaceted and discussions like these are raised, I feel like it's completely fine to read it. That's my thoughts. Mm. So good. I was not gonna eat the whole thing, but. I'm gonna edit my haul video. And I'm gonna try and vlog more for you guys. I'm working right now, nine to six. So honestly, it's it hasn't been you know the most vloggable week. And I don't know if you guys would find like a work vlog interesting. Oh my God, I have like the worst back pain. I feel like I have a really bad neck. Let's see. Hey everyone, today I'm working from home and this is my lunch. Mm. Also have some of these noodles. So spicy. Also hot. I'm gonna watch, should I watch Nevertheless or should I watch Grey's Anatomy? I'm gonna watch Grey's because it's more fast paced, I think, compared to Nevertheless.
transplant candidate. Someone can't reliably take their anti-rejection meds. I can't. Or... First time I try chicken feet. Okay, let's try it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 이제부터 많이 먹겠습니다. Mm -hmm. 